My name is John Dotto. I'm with Case Construction. I'm the brand marketing manager for skid loaders and compact track loaders. And the machine you see behind us right now is our DL450 concept crossover, or we're calling it Project Minotaur. Um, and what we've done is we've looked at a niche in the marketplace where a contractor's using a large CTL with a dozer blade to do a lot of earth moving uh, small application dirt work type jobs. Um, one of the disadvantages of a large CTL with a dozer blade on it is when you pick those loader arms up off the stops, you're starting to run force through the arms of the machine and not through the chassis. We saw that as a challenge and we uh, posed the challenge to our engineering group who have developed this concept crossover that you're seeing here at Con Expo this year, um, wherein we've got an integrated C-frame assembly that will put the force of a dozing application through the frame of the machine. It allows you to use a larger dozer blade like you see here on the machine, a 90 inch uh, blade, and also allows you to integrate, in this case, uh, Leica Geo Systems 3D grade control system. Um, we're also using, instead of traditional um, skid steer or track loader style joysticks, you've got dozer style controls in this machine. Instead of having a traditional ISO H pattern crossover switch, you've got an ISO to dozer control uh, switch in the cab. So you truly do have a CTL, you get all the benefits of the full multifunctionality of a CTL and the full benefits of a little dozer when you make the conversion with our uh, patent pending C-frame assembly. Um, in addition to those couple things, we've got uh, prototype LED light bar on this machine, integrated rear ripper, integrated sweeps, integrated uh, backup camera. In the machine, when you sit down in the operator's seat, you see the uh, integrated rear view camera in your upper left. The Leica Geo Systems 3D grade control screen is in your upper right. Um, it's got a great feel to it. Um, it's a big, powerful machine that we think is going to fit that niche market in between a large CTL and a small dozer because they're just getting used in, in, in that type of work. Um, and this is a better this is a better way to do that small dirt working application. The, a lot of a lot of uh, the comments we've been getting are uh, is this looks like this looks a lot like in size uh, my old 450 dozer, and that that's part of the reason we call this one the DL 450 is it does kind of harken back to the days of the small dozer. Um, so I, I think we're I think we're right on the mark with that, um, and we. We've been getting a lot of excited responses uh, from contractors who are, who are looking for this type of machine. They want a little dozer, but what you get with this is the additional multifunctionality of the CTL aspect. Of it. One of the things that we're doing this week is we're doing focus groups with contractors to ask them about the types of systems that we're, uh, we're in development of. Uh, right now, when you go to attach to this dozer blade, you, uh, you, you attach with the traditional skid steer CTL uh, mounting plate at the front of the machine and then the C-frame assembly is, uh, is attached underneath. How we're gonna get that done uh, is, is largely gonna be decided through the contractor focus groups we're having uh, this week. Is it an automated experience? Is there some type of uh, a roll and lift procedure that you go through to get that connection made? Um, we, will, we will be figuring that out uh, with the help of our contractors this week. After last Con Expo 2014, um, about a year after that, we went to the engineering group and, and asked them uh, to, to start this project. Um, and we threw it to a small group of engineers and uh, uh, basically some several different crossover concepts were examined. Um, this was the one that made the most sense for Case, for our contractors, for where we think the market is headed with large CTLs. If, you, if a contractor can utilize fewer pieces of equipment in his fleet um, to do more jobs, uh, it just makes sense. So to have a small, uh, versatile machine like a CTL, but then have an additional capability, uh, it's, it's about productivity, it's about being as efficient as possible. A CTL is a great machine for moving dirt. We've made it more efficient with this, uh, this C-frame assembly uh, and the compact dozer loader um, would be, would be the, uh, the, the category that we're trying to, uh, to, to start here. Take a compact track loader, cross it with a small dozer, and you get a compact dozer loader.